What am I going to call? Yeah, that's what this is called. I'm right, you're wrong. Why is it I'm right, you're wrong? Because I want it to be. Why? Why? Do you... Because that's what I want. That, that That's a good title. Do you need some Advil? Okay, I'm going to try to vibe. Is that is that what we do now that we're this we're, sounds like we're Gen Z? study music? If you ever had to do a bunch of schoolwork and have been deprived of every motivation left in your body, you definitely went on YouTube and looked for study music, and See, that's what we've done. Is you look up for calming study music, and this is exactly what it sounds like. I I would. In my brain, it would be harder for me to work with something with a beat because like as a drummer and like, you know, back in my days when I was, you know, rapping, I would just start like trying to freestyle. Uh, don't want to do this homework. No work. Make it go away. Yep. Uh, and then I'd be like, damn it, math. And then I, that would just keep going. You know, I couldn't do it. I can do like piano. Or maybe like a light acoustic guitar, as long as it's like not any real. Like, it this is too jammy. Like for this me, is... it can't be new. Like if I'm doing, even if it's a show, like that's why I loved rewatching, like Hey Hey Jesse and or Jesse was the name of it, but anyways, Jesse and Good Luck Charlie and all those things. That's why I loved rewatching them while I did a lot of my artwork because mm -hmm. nothing's new. And that's why I memorized so many of the scripts and so many of like the monologues that happened is because I would literally just replay. Do you remember when we play that mm -hmm. game where you yeah. pick a pick a season and pick an episode and I would be you know saying yeah I would just that's why. I would scroll to a random episode and you would immediately start quoting every line <laughs> back and forth doing everybody's dialogue and I was like it's a little creepy. But what else did you do with your life back there? I replayed it. Well, while I did my art or like was cleaning my room. I knew everything that happened, even a lot of like just the overall mm -hmm. everything. I just, I don't know. I, I'm trying to. So it's important that you talk directly into the center. I of that know, little but I'm, hole. I'm trying to download this and you started it already. Now I got pressure on me. Oh, you're stressing me out. It sounds like you have daughter issues. This is dad issues. What this is. <laughs> so. <laughs> You have an old man whistle in it, your throat. Is that is that how I laugh? Yes. Ruff, 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 ruff. yes, that is exactly how you laugh. It won't let me do this. I don't think you need the app. I think you can just go to the website. So There is no website for an app. There's got to be a website for it. This is, <laughs> this is the problem with Gen Z. You are you a problem. You think things live in apps. I promise you, think, apps are just pointing you to websites. Well... Maybe you, because you don't know no, what you're doing. No, no, no. I was in information technology no. for 13 years before I started getting no. paid to make dick jokes. You sound like Patrick. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, trying to, I'm trying to explain to you that the, the app is just pointing you to a server where there's a website existing. So this game that you're trying to get me to play right now is... On a website somewhere, I promise you. What's it called? Don't worry about it. I've never heard of that. I might have found a different version. Uh, see, now the website is leading me to the app store. I wonder why. I'm not I'm saying... Not no, no, no. I'm not saying there's not... Your Apps point you to a server and there's a page on a server. I'm calling that a website. That's where the data is stored is on the internet. I don't care where it's stored. What I'm saying is there's a way to access it. From, tell me what it's called. I bet you I can find it. I just found a different one with a different one. So So what's it called? Don't so that they it. know. No, they need to know what game we're playing. It's basically a would you rather or pick between like comparing things. So for example. But what app, what did you call the other for one? Example, when you told me about this, what did you call it? For example. You hear me talking to you? I asked you a question. What did you call it when you opened up your app and you were like, I'm not getting paid to say this. You are. You are <laughs> you are getting paid to say this. Would you rather? That's not what it's no, 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 stop. What what was it called? What was the app called? Wishbone. Wishbone. 
Why was it so hard for you to tell me that? Because I didn't want to. <laughs> I don't know Go why ahead. that was so... Ish- what do you mean? Would you rather break your arm or break your leg? Um, My leg. Are there... Do I get to pick which leg? Sure. No. Well, I mean, my right leg means no. I can't drive. My left leg, I could still drive. That's a, literally a massive. No, you have fifty-fifty chance on both. Uh, I, I'd go. Oh, mm-hmm. it could be my right arm. Yeah, I'd say leg. I would go with arm. Wait, are we talking about the pain? I'm wrong. I mean. <laughs> I mean, it's called <laughs> I'm Right, You're Wrong. So you just, you settled it. I think the show's over now. It was a quick episode. Yeah. <laughs> you just admitted to being wrong on I'm Right, You're Wrong. My mild dyslexic came out there for a minute. I mean, I'm right, you're wrong. There we go. Oh. No arm for sure, because I, I would, I, I have to re- rely on fewer people. If I, uh, if, if I'm... If one of my legs are broken, I'm going to need more help from other individuals because I'm. It's going to be hard for me to walk, hard for me to get around, uh, hard for me to get groceries or put things up. Like I'm going to need someone to come over and help we me order do stuff. Our groceries. Yeah, but I still got to move them. And you know how many trips I made from the door to the kitchen, and then all the stuff. That, I mean, I worked for probably 40 minutes just putting all the groceries up. You're wrong. So because... I would rather do that one-handed with working legs than to have to be hobbling around with two hands because I I would need more assistance from other people. I don't want to put somebody else out and be a burden on them. So I would rather, I'd rather be able to walk around for myself. Okay, But you do a podcast and you're a comedian. You kind of need your hands for that. And, and for typing on the computer, writing emails, typing on your phone. Yeah. I can do all of it with one hand. No. Yes, I can. I can do this podcast one handed. Here's how I'm thinking about too. If I were to fall. One handed. If I were to fall, I'm going to want to catch myself. Yep. That would hurt. Well, but if you're, you're wrong. You're wrong. What else you got? Uh, let, let us know in the comments if you'd rather break your leg or break your arm. Wow. 33% of people said break your leg. 67 said your arm. So I'm right. I guess you're you could, wrong. I guess if something's wrong, you could run away. Yeah. I think it you just makes also drive. me feel, I think from like my head to like. The middle of my stomach is like my little bubble. It's like the real you. This is the real me. Your legs are just the like yeah, they're what, just... what gets you around. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. So to me, it's yeah. like if something isn't working, it kind of gives me a little bit of a panic. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I, get I, it. I would constantly keep it like in my chest because I wouldn't want anything to happen to it. Okay. But my leg, I'm just like, eh. okay. Yeah. But let us know in the comments on each one of these, by the way, if you would rather. Would you rather be a cat or a dog? Dog, <laughs> by far. I don't know, man. So I like dogs more, but cats are more independent. They're more respected. They're more... uh, Like, I think a cat can live out in the wilderness or out in... Out in the wild, or out in just the the world, more than a dog. I think a dog relies more on more on humans. So, as much as I prefer dogs and I love dogs more, I I would rather be a cat. Because people wouldn't want to. Here's my thing: when you drive by a cat, it's like, oh, they're fine outside. Yeah, you're never concerned. You drive by a dog, you're like, (gasps) we gotta help him. Yeah, Yeah. which is why I'd want to be a dog. Yeah, you. I'd be like, dogs look like they need to be rescued. Cats look like they want to be left the hell alone. Right, so I'll be sitting on a pillow getting hand-fed treats. Treats? Treats? What is wrong with my English today? I'm right, getting you're Getting hand-fed treats while you're left alone to eat the bones of someone else's um, dinner. Yeah, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with 33% cat. 33% cat, 67% said dog. I think that's a knee-jerk reaction to what they like more. I think more people like dogs than cats. But they haven't, they haven't, those people didn't think this through. They're wrong, basically. They're wrong. No. They're wrong. A yacht or have a private jet? <laughs> private jet. Whoa, what was that? That was very loud. Was that me? My, my thing never makes that noise. I don't know. That was weird. That was weird. It sounded like it came through... Like the, the microphone, like the microphone had notification. Yeah. 
Yeah, they could uh, have been my laptop. Mine, but I don't, mine would be private jet. I don't think so. Yeah, I think that's the. I mean, I, I prefer to be on the water than in the air. Um, I don't want to be on the water. But I, you know, flying to flying to comedy shows, I think would make way more sense than being on a boat, right? Yes. I have a yeah, question, jet. and you know my answer to it. Wait, what did they say? What was the percentage? Sorry. Uh, good question. I don't know yet. Hey, you're going to have to work this out so that you can talk into the microphone and do it. You can lower that mic. Yeah, I need to do that. You just twist that little thingy right there? Twist I it right there? this one. Th that's what I said. I think you pointed to the wrong one. That's a, Nope. Because I know how this one works. That's how I was... That's exactly what I was pointing to. <laughs> there you go. Live in an area that is prone to earthquakes or live in an area that is prone to flooding? What's my answer? <laughs> earthquakes. Yeah. For sure. I have a definite... You're not loud enough. Bring them up. You got to bring it up. Have a deathly f phobia, deathly s scared, deathly. What is the word? You have a death, deathly scared, fear. scaredia. Fear. There we go. Scaredia. Scaredia, of tsunamis or any type of flooding like that. I can't stand it. So I'm getting the music as low as I can, but you're talking softer as this podcast is going on, and I keep turning the music well, down more. You need, and it's going to be, and you just keep getting. Then you should your get music. an upgrade on your mixer because that sucks. You'd rather be in an area with earthquakes or flooding, Ed? Um, probably earthquakes. I'm right, you're wrong. What, we said the same thing. So 54% said... Earth Did the door just open by itself? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Go get him, Nyla. Hold on. Did that door just open? Yeah. The air conditioner wasn't on. Did you turn it back on? No. That's the only thing that would make the door open, unless there's a person walking around out there. Yeah, that could be. I'm going to turn the vibes back on so that it could be one of those weird things where if I'm getting murdered, there's like vibey background music to the right. violence. Yeah. Like a Quentin Tarantino film. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go check it out. Okay. I'll keep one. You're going to stay off. here and uh, commentate on what's going on? Yeah. You you explain what's happening. I'm gonna go risk my life. He took on, his Nyla. headphones off. He is walking. Come on, Nyla. Why are you calling the dog? Yeah. Leave yeah. Nyla in here. No, we're gonna go check this out. Oh, he's gonna go check it out. Meaning he's gonna send the dog go in get, harm's way. Yeah, that's that's what he really means. Well, I don't hear a scream, so I think he's alive. Let's just hope. The dog isn't hurt. That's really the main thing we want to avoid here. <laughs> Why would you do that? That's nowhere near okay <laughs> under any circumstance. Ever. Are you dumb? <laughs> Don't do that. <sighs> Nyla. Did he scare you? Okay. Okay. Lay down. Down. <laughs> I couldn't find anything. So if they were here, they, they left. Did, it, did I scare you? I just came back in the room a little faster. I just came back in the studio a little quicker than I normally would have. Just a little bit. Last one. Okay. <sighs> did you fall asleep? Oh. This music makes me fall asleep. Would you rather be born again today or be born again in a hundred years ago? Oh, be born again a hundred years ago. There we go. Born again. I don't want to go to church at all. What does that have to do? <laughs> People... People born, born, born again. Years. Okay. Well, knowing you, you'd figure that out about 16, 17, you wouldn't go. You said being born again. Being born again means you accept Jesus into your life. So I was... Does it? That's not what this says. You've created that. You've made that relation. Being born again means to be I don't think religious. It does. I don't think it does. 
think you literally are, does. No, no, no. This is this is not again, a this is not an opinion. I'm telling you, this is a literal fact of human life. I'm telling you, human to be life to be born again means you wrong. have accepted Jesus. You're wrong. No, it's a I literal think thing. That is one of the things that can be attached to this. But I think being born again are their own words by themselves. Okay, so this just mean, means literally born. That's what I said. Again, that's what I said. Well, you said born again, and typically when people put them together like that, they mean okay. You put Jesus. it together if that's what you want. I'm not gonna put that together. Today you were born, or 100 years ago you were born? Definitely today. Today's the best time to be alive. As terrible as everything is, can you imagine the lack of medical equipment and lack of entertainment? You, yeah. GPS, yeah. iPhones, That's internet, true. lack of information? Pfft. Are you kidding? It's I don't know. basically trying to get me to decide, do I want to almost be racist and homophobic, mm -hmm. or do I want to watch climate change burn the world to its core? I'm going to go with neither. <laughs> I just don't want to choose. Um, I'm going to go. Never work. have existed at all. <laughs> there we go. Check. Check. We agree. We agree. So is this a, is this a game that people play? Uh, I know it's you called like a would you rather. What is the wishbone thing? Because the thing you showed me had, like, characters I on. know. I want to do that one. And until we figure that one out, we have to deal with this one. Wishbone is just basically, like, you know, Eddie or Steve from Stranger Things, which clearly the answer is Eddie. Um, but you just kind of go back and forth, and it tells you the percentages of which, you know, how many people did that one as well. Or, like, donuts or ice cream or, you know, characters, again, it'll do other stuff too. Dustin or L, you know. Who did it say, Mike, Dustin, or Mike? Yeah, Dustin or Mike. I think is what there was another one, but it doesn't matter. It's just characters or general beach or mountains. You know what I mean? Mm, okay, it's kind of a would you rather, but yeah, but with more simpler. So what we've learned today is I'm right and you're wrong. I'm right, you're wrong. I did state earlier that I was wrong, but that was by accident. <laughs> Oh, so you were wrong when you no. said it. No, well, yeah. <laughs> Got stuck in that one, didn't I? <laughs> were you in this podcast? Uh, it is officially ended.